The 90 Day Fiancé franchise has aired many fights between featured couples, but some of the worst arguments have been due to siblings. While the rare 90 Day Fiancé sibling has been kind and understanding, unfortunately, this isn't often the case. Many siblings in the 90 Day Fiancé franchise have instead tried their hardest to implode relationships within their families, and alienate foreign partners. Since the 90 Day Fiancé franchise focuses on international romances, there are a lot of issues for couples to overcome. Duos who wish to marry must grapple with unique challenges, including major moves, language barriers, and cultural differences. When family and friends support the featured couple, the process is usually smoother and happier. However, animosity and conflict from family members can complicate things and lead to major fights and massive unhappiness. In some cases, sibling conflict can even threaten the future of featured franchise relationships. There are several main reasons why 90 Day Fiancé family members, including siblings, have meddled in relationships. Sometimes American family members don't trust the foreign partner and believe that they are using the American partner for a green card or a new life. On the other hand, Foreign siblings have also been against American partners. Often, this is because they don't think the American is good enough for their family member. Overall, animosity from unsupportive siblings has rocked many 90 Day Fiancé franchise relationships. Biniam Sheeper and Ariella Weinberg have dealt with many relationship obstacles on 90 Day Fiancé, the other way. However, Biniam's sisters Wish and Mimi have always been around to try and worsen their issues. The two women helped to raise Biniam and are extremely overprotective of the Ethiopian dancer. Wish and Mimi believe that Ariella wants to control their brother and that she isn't good enough for him. This has led to many conflicts, as Wish and Mimi try to make Ariella insecure in her relationship. Most recently, Wish and Mimi were enraged when Ariella and Biniam said they were moving to the United States. This led to the women flinging red wine in Ariella's face out of rage. Many viewers slammed the two women for their shockingly bad behavior, though the sister blamed editors for the argument. It's no secret that Wish and Mimi dislike Ariella and don't think that her relationship with Biniam will last. However, Ariella's own sister isn't a source of support and love either. 90 Day Fiancé fans voiced their strong dislike of Ariella's condescending sister Kristen due to the way she spoke about Ethiopia. Kristen shocked and enraged viewers with a patronizing and negative way that she spoke about life in Africa, as she heavily implied that she found it unsafe and believed America to be far superior. Ariella has been praised for respectfully and openly embracing Ethiopian culture. Therefore, Viewers were particularly shocked by the attitude of her sister. The other way couple Evelyn B. Yegos and Corey Rathgeber have a historically rocky relationship since Evelyn often is cruel towards her husband. However, Evelyn is not alone in her cruelty. Her sisters Leslie and Lipsy are just as eager to join Evelyn in ganging up on Corey. The three women enjoy talking badly about 90 Day Fiancé simp Corey both behind his back and to his face. They have made no secret of the fact that they believe Evelyn is too good for him. Leslie and Lipsy even tricked Corey into eating bull penis soup on camera in an attempt to humiliate him. Many viewers feel as though the Biegas sisters are people whom Corey should stay far away from. Related, 90 Day Fiancé cast members accused of looking better before weight loss not all in-laws are created equal. And this is something that Kalani Fagata learned when she met her husband Asuelu Pula's mother and sister. Lucina and Tammy Pula expect a lot from Asuelu, as the women believe that the Samoan man should send money to support his family. However, 90 Day Fiancé's Kalani has urged Asuelu to spend his money on her and their two sons. The money issues, and the entitlement that Tammy and Lucina display, have caused many brawls that have almost resulted in physical violence. Tammy is not shy about threatening her sister-in-law Kalani and the way that she demands things from her brother is outrageous. Tammy has accused Kalani of brainwashing Asuelu on 90 Day Fiancé, happily ever after? Since Kalani doesn't want Asuelu sending large sums of money that he can't afford to his family, many 90 Day Fiancé fans consider Tammy to be a true nightmare of a sister-in-law. The 90 Day Fiancé franchise has seen many siblings behaving badly, but Nicole Gimino has consistently ranked as one of the worst in-laws in the entire franchise. The younger sister of the family Chantel star Pedro Gimino cannot stand his 90 Day Fiancé wife, Chantel Gimino. Everett. Nicole has made her dislike of Chantel known many times, including when she exposed Chantel's cosmetic procedures on social media. Nicole has also taken her dislike of Chantel very far by trying to actively end Pedro's marriage to her. Nicole has tried to get her best friend Karima Morla to encourage Pedro to cheat on Chantel. Nicole even started rumors that Pedro slept with Karima to unsuccessfully get Chantel to leave her brother. Libby Pothuston and Dre Castravet have kept their marriage afloat despite their relationship being panned by viewers. While the duo revealed a surprisingly intact relationship on Happy
happily ever after? Season 6, they have experienced much strife due to Libby's meddling family. Libby's siblings Becky, Charlie, and Jen Podhust are all franchise villains. The trio became enraged when Andre wanted to join their father's family house flipping business, as they didn't want Andre earning any money for Libby that they felt entitled to. While all three siblings have been panned for being greedy and entitled, Charlie has earned extra criticism from 90 Day Fiancé fans. Viewers accused the aggressive Charlie of using drugs, especially when he freaked out at Andre and physically fought him. Overall, the entire Podhust family has been slammed by franchise fans.